Today I'm going to be teaching you how to foam mod your mechanical keyboard to not only make it sound better, but trust me, it's going to feel amazing once you're done. First thing you need to do is take off all the keycaps. This might take a while, so let me just speed up the process. Once you've taken off all the keycaps, just clean it off a little bit because you've already taken them all off, might as well clean it a little bit. Then you want to unscrew any screws that are visible, then turn it around and see if you have any screws on the back. If you don't, it might just be plastic bits like this. Unclip all of those and then separate the keyboard into the bottom and the top of the case. Then you should have the screws holding in the little USB-C or micro USB-C connector. Unscrew those and take the whole thing out. Then you've just got the bottom of your case with nothing inside it, which is what makes the hollow pinging sound on your keyboard that you're trying to get rid of with this foam mod. Once you have that, uh, clean it off a little bit just because you've already got it open and you're never going to clean the inside of the case probably. And then start to lay in your foam and cut it to size. Um, mine didn't cut to size exactly, but that's fine. As long as you've got all the holes where the screws are supposed to be exposed and your foam fits in the majority of the bottom of the case, that's fine. Then just screw back in the little USB connector. Once you have that screwed back in, start to put everything back together. And then at the end, your keyboard should be foam modded. Now it doesn't sound like it's gonna do much, but trust me, a foam modded keyboard just feels so much better. The ping sound you get when you use the bottom out isn't a thing anymore and it just feels better. Uh, yeah, this has been a very short video, but foam modding a keyboard isn't really that hard to do. And um, hopefully you can experience it for yourself. Just about any foam works really, I just use some packaging foam that came with my uh, headphones here, but literally any foam that fits in the case and is thin enough uh, should be fine. It's been a pretty short video, but I will see you on Monday. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and thank you for watching.